Welcome to A Weekend with Miles, Seattle. This is the very first episode, so it's not going to be the best, but it's going to be a good one. I didn't have my cameraman, but next time I will, and every video will get better as I go on. First start, I had a flight at 12.55 a.m., and you'll see the sun's still out. That's how it is in Alaska. Hey, here's the first episode of A Weekend with Miles, and I'm heading to Seattle, and I'm leaving Fairbanks right now. It's about 11.45, and the flight leaves in an hour. See you later. When I got there, I got first class for the very first time. I never had that before, so I was enjoying it, drinking a nice beer, having a nice first class meal, and watching some TV. And I had nobody sitting next to me. On behalf of Delta Airlines and our Sky Team Alliance partners worldwide, I'd like to welcome you to Seattle. Local time here is approximately 5.16 a.m. Hey, I just landed in Seattle and I'm trying to get on the public transit, maybe find the light rail. And I've been walking for a while through this place. And I think I'm getting closer. I'm trying to go out there. It's a little, it's a little bit chilly this morning. But it's supposed to get nice. Once I landed, I tried to find how to get to my friend DJ's house. I met him in Maui like two years ago. And then I visited him in San Diego a couple times. So I took the light rail. I never did that before there. And then after that, I was going to try to take a bus, but I couldn't figure it out. So I just got in a taxi, and that cost me 15 bucks. The guy went the wrong way, and I still tipped him 2 bucks. Probably shouldn't have tipped him. Then I finally made it to my friend DJ's house. Hey, I finally made it to my friend's house. Oh, that's a nice view over there. Downtown Seattle over there. And I woke him up because <laughs> it was like 5.30 a.m., 6 a.m., something. And after I got to DJ's house, I just went to sleep for like three hours, four hours. And then my friend Mike hit me up and he was ready to go show me the city of Seattle. All right, I've been sleeping like three hours now on DJ's couch. It's nice and comfortable, but it's time to go have some fun. My friend Mike's about to be here and pick me up in like 30 minutes. So I got to get shower, get fresh and everything. I'm still like asleep. I haven't slept much. I'm ready to go though. But while I was waiting for Mike, I just had a jam session, just bored, so I thought I'd do something. I was just sitting here in DJ's house waiting for my friend Mike to come pick me up, so I thought I'd have a jam session. Are you ready? All right. Whoa, that's a hit song right there. I finally met up with Mike. Hey, I'm about to see my friend Mike, who I haven't seen in four years. I met him back in Kona. Whoa, Miles, what's up, Mike? I miss you, Mike. <laughs> no, no, you're, oh, you're over, overacting. <laughs> All right, we already met, but I just wanted to get it again because I didn't have the camera. Show me a city, and we had a good talk about our times in Kona, Hawaii. That was four whole years ago. I haven't seen him since then. So he showed me a city, and we went to Fremont first to see a troll under the bridge. I didn't know that's what it was at first. <laughs> and then we just drive around the city. Here we have some cute joggers. Oh, uh, I mean, oh, I mean, this is Fremont. <laughs> <laughs> and there's Lake Washington. All right. And then we get to the Space Needle. Hey, Mike. Here's Mike, who I met in Kona four years ago. Hang loose, brah. <laughs> there it is. Oh. Which I really wanted to see, but it costs like $19 to go up, so I was like, I'll save that money for some drinks. So I got some lunch at this, I don't remember what place, some place. <laughs> and I got some fish and chips. I have a terrible British accent. Alright, I was all filled up with food and beer, and I was ready to go see some more of the city. So we went to find the sculpture part, but we didn't find the real one. He thought it was, he didn't know his own city. He had only been living there like a year though. All right, what he thinks, what Mike thinks is a sculpture park. He doesn't know It is. It are. is a sculpture park. This is the Sonic Blue. It is sculpture, so I'm calling it a sculpture park. Right now I don't have my cameraman, <laughs> so I'm gonna hire Mike as a cameraman. Yes, no. sir. <laughs> You're in the video too, Mike. Yeah, buddy. All right, we're just gonna walk through this beautiful day in Seattle. Beautiful day. Just had some fish and chips and a beer. 
And now we're heading to more sculptures this way. There's some sculptures. Check back later. Then we finally found the real sculpture park, which was kind of disappointing. All right, we found the actual sculpture park right here. You did. Mike was wrong. He I didn't know over, where we a, were. It's over there. And it's over here too. <laughs> Look at this beautiful day. You see the water out there. Beautiful. Oh, and they got the duck tour. It's on the road and the water. Then we went on a walk downtown and then there was a water fountain, took a picture by it. It was a beautiful day, like high 70s. It's not what you think of Seattle, like you think rain. You guys jealous yet back in Alaska? Because it's a beautiful day here. <laughs> All right, checking in again. Now we're heading to Pike Market. And over Woo! Here we got the Ferris wheel, we got all the wire, we got all this. Life's good right now. Where you at? Then finally got to one of the other big places, Pike Marketplace. Finally made it to the whatever this place is, some market. Pike Place Market is that Pike Place. Called? All right, we're here. I think it's overrated, but let's go get a drink. He hasn't, and see he's what only happens. been he's only been here for like three minutes. <laughs> let's get a drink. He's already formed an opinion. I was kind of disappointed at first, but then it got kind of cool. Then we went and just started drinking. Did my first Irish car bomb. Here we go. Mike's a little bit slow. But a lot of the action was not on camera because it died while I was in the very first bar. But after that, we went to like four more bars for the whole day. And at nighttime, we went and partied out in Ballard, Ballard and had a good time there at a dancing bar. Then that was it for that day, and then it was Sunday. So, my friend DJ, he got me free tickets to the Mariners game. Shout out DJ. All right, I'd like to give a shout out to DJ for giving me and Mike some free Thank tickets. Thank you, DJ. Thank you, DJ. And look at our seats. I'm excited. That was my very first professional sport game I ever went to. I'd rather NBA, but MLB was cool. Then it was back home or work. Well, I'm back at Fairbanks now, and that wraps up an episode of A Weekend with Miles.